when you do stem cells for hair, it will actually help. A lot of people come to us for problems with thinning hair. A lot of ladies after they've given birth have thin hair. Two things, PRP and stem cells. Personally, I like stem cells. Stem cells, a stem cell can become anything. When you do stem cells for hair, it will actually help regenerate and thicken hair. It will go into the follicle and help grow that. PRP, on the other hand, is just more nourishment, but a stem cell can become a hair follicle. It can become anything. When we do the stem cells for the hair, we inject, we basically carpet bomb, and we concentrate on the area of the hair loss. We also use PRP to give it the nourishment. What I like about the stem cells for the hair is that Unlike PRP, you don't need to do it so many times. For great results for your hair with PRP, you're looking at five, six, seven, eight, nine times, once a month. If you live here, great, why not? If you don't live here, it starts to become a little bit difficult. Price-wise, basically same price as doing all those PRPs. It's a good treatment. One thing I cannot do, this is another thing that people ask me, if you're bald, if you've got the Sahara thing going on up here, we can't do anything about that. But if you have a little bit of hair, the, the stem cells will replicate that and grow the hair. It takes a few months, but it's a really, really good treatment. And as everyone knows by now, we use fresh stem cells. The quality is amazing. Have a think about that. If you're interested in hair growth, think about if you don't want to do repetitive treatments here. I'm very happy to see you anyway. But if you don't want to see my ugly face a lot, just come and do it once. Mm -hmm.